as the teams make their way out onto Stamford Bridge for one final time in 2022. Group A is set for its conclusion and tonight the battle for the top spot is on between Chelsea and Paris Saint-Germain. Chelsea looking to gain a bit of control in this game. And James misses out. Diani goes from distance. Oh, hits the crossbar. As I said earlier, she's dropping in in the pockets, but also she's she's got the pace to run in behind, and you just see there then the ability. Cuthbert tries to play on the ball to find Kirby. Plenty of options in the box for Chelsea, and one of them's James. Yeah, took the words out of my mouth there. It's definitely Chelsea's best opportunity. And this is what I'm saying about PSG. They take chances. And, and Chelsea are able to profit from it here. It's a, a good early ball through. And Frank Kirby, I think she's ever so well with that. A little bit tentative, but now looking a lot more threatening. Sam Kurt back out to James. Warren James looks to get the shot away. It was on target too, and it forced the save from Buadi. Feet with, with equal sort of power and ability and does so so well here that you can see when it was, you know the angle that's behind it that we just saw the trajectory of the ball it moves all different types of ways a little step over is there as well there cheeky but this will see it when she hits it it's it took a, a bit of a deflection well, I think Buhardi actually does really there's Buchanan lovely play from Cuthbert Searching for Lauren James. Great turn. James in now for Chelsea. Important touch from Buadi. Save, but this is all about Aaron Cuthbert. There's a little nutmeg initially here. Plays it round one side of the player, runs round the other. It's a good ball as well. Lauren James does well, uses her body and her body strength. And then you think she's maybe going to lay it back to Frank Kirby, but takes the shot on. Buadi gets a, a hand to it, does really well. I thought it was a goal. Chelsea certainly started to get a grip of what PSG were, were threatening in the opening 15 minutes or so because as you said Courtney they've not really done much in the last 15 minutes and Chelsea have been the more likely team to score as Sam Kerr makes her way through looks to dance and get the shot away oh, it's a brilliant goal from Sam Kerr that is just what she does and Sam Kerr puts Chelsea in the lead before half time trying to to face forward to get on the ball Chelsea do well to to win the ball initially and she's just on a front foot she's anticipating the loose ball cuts inside and from there on a weaker foot but you wouldn't know past Buardi right in that top right hand corner it's an absolutely wonderful finish Hamraoui spotted a, a good ball over to Mengwen Lee Diani and cut short was able to get the shot away that is the danger that she poses she was being surrounded by plenty of those blue shirts Kerr to right in has spotted Frank Kirby making a way inside the penalty area back out it goes and the hit from Guru right in just wide times have we seen her from that sort of angle bend the ball in the net she's running onto it and with that favoured left foot. See what she's trying to do. She's trying to use the defender almost as a little bit of a screen to, to bend round. And, and well, this is uh, our group A is looking. Opportunity again for Chelsea and it's Lauren James who takes a full advantage. Chelsea double their lead. And surely that is the top spot in Group A sealed. The goal kick before it's got pounced upon by Wright and didn't quite come off. But then Chelsea high pressing. They play it round at the back. Sam Kerr does really well here with this ball first time. There's still a lot to do for Lauren James, by the way. She's the one that initially is there, gets the touch. Frank Kirby plays it early. The first time ball from Sam Kerr and it's a wonderful finish. And with the delivery not quite cleared away by Chelsea it's a bit of a mess in the box and 
Giora was able to play it out to Backman again. Manova, Rowie tried to get the head to it. Lee back in, Ilstead over to left by Bright. And Chelsea will be happy to see that run out from the goal kick. I like the both deliveries from Backman. You see this one right into the pack, causes a bit of chaos. PSG just gives it all. Be really positive for them. Nice turn from Sam Kerr, Ericsson on to right and great ball in, finds Kirby, cuts it back to Lauren James for a second. And Chelsea have their third. Great movement from Chelsea. Topped off by Lauren James. I love watching this. It's the little drop in that Sam Kerr's been doing all game. Wonderful turn. First time ball inside. This ball from Wrighton is exceptional. And then the presence of mind from Frank Kirby. How many players would take that on themselves? But she knows that Lauren James is there. So wonderful. Little lay back and then another fantastic finish from Lauren James. Giora. Okay, wants it. Leaves away in, gets the chance. That was a brilliant opportunity too for the young substitution. This is where, despite being three in a look, Chelsea have you know they've still got to be better. I think Millie Bright needs to get out faster. What a strike. By Connor Reed. Now Kirby leaves it for Beth England. England! Just wide. Should be disappointed with that. Again, it's good play by Chelsea, the way that they play it round. Bethany England, she does so well here to hold her run to keep herself on side. The first touch is good, and you see what she's trying to do as all forward to talk, get it across the goalkeeper. She's just trying to find that here to hold her run to keep herself on side. The first touch is good, and you see what she's trying to do. Kirby, great ball in. Couldn't quite get there. The chance is there, though, and off the post. Yeah, I think this takes a deflection on the way through she's controlled with that she doesn't try and put a lace so with the delivery for Chelsea and Ericsson almost got that it's a good ball in got bags of pace on it the Chelsea and Arsenal that to look forward to and of course they will be looking forward to Champions League quarter-final stages which will be coming up in March. It's Chelsea who take the top spot in Group A after a convincing win.